Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to uh, Chrono Cross. Let's continue exploring uh, the uh, village here. I got some uh, places still to uh, go. This is a residential tower. To the north of this village lies Earth Dragon Isle, which the we locals call the land where the dragon sleeps. Until a few years ago, the surface was covered with sand, but somehow the sand disappeared completely overnight. Hmm, interesting. Let's see what's down here. What? Don't you bother me. I'm going. I got to concentrate and concentrate. Yeah, that's Corch's uh, sister there, I believe. Climb up onto the beds. Kitty! Oh, I can't interact with the kitty. Disappointing. Something behind one of these, I think. Might not be on this level. Oh, hi there. There isn't much here, but feel at home. Feel right at home. found feathery dress it's empty little uh, storage room with a uh, with some armor uh, excuse me kid All right, I think we can climb up here yeah there we go new around here, right? Do you know what these wires are for? If you don't know, I'll teach you for a special price of 5G. Uh, alright, I'll pay the uh, 5G. For teaching you, I'll need that 5G. <laughs> you paid 5G. Okay, here goes with the quick rundown of the whole gadget. This wire connects to the docks. There is also a second wire connected to the shrine. Basically, it's a shortcut to the docks. You can get there a lot faster than walking, plus it feels great. Well, the only problem is that you can't come back the same way. Can't defy gravity, you know? Yes, do you want to become the wind? Yes, let's become the wind. That'll be 5G in advance. Alright. You paid 5G. <laughs> thanks. Okay, ready? Have a safe flight. Wee! Bye, guys! Wee! I guess they joined me. Alright, uh, let's see. Alright, so we did pick up um, Magic Ring, improves magic power by one. Lesser Pendragon Sigil changes weapon element to that of last element attack received. Low level elements only. That's interesting. I think don't know how useful that is right now. It's probably some uh, some bosses that where that would be super useful for no nope. for some people. Uh, copper rod. We can get that equipped. Hit percentage actually goes down. That is annoying. Oh, and as someone pointed out, and I should have, well, it's been a really long time since I've uh, taken uh, chemistry. Uh, CA is calcium. For the, because uh, it's bone. Alright, fe feathery dress, a female use only. 
defense goes down, magic defense goes up. Um, eh, we'll save. We'll, we'll hold off. Okay, so improves magic power. I think that's good. And silver loop. Loop A improves hit percentage. Sure. Alright, let's go this way now. Um, would you like to become the wind? Uh, I won't become the wind. Oh, that's too bad. Say, have you ever heard of the six dragons? In this world, there's supposedly six dragon gods. The six great dragons descend from the heavens to seal away evil and promise eternal prosperity across the land. This is part of an old song that's been passed down in El Nido for a long time. I wonder what they look like. This is a dragon shrine, residence of our chief, Shaman Daria. Please be sure to act courteously, courteously on the premises. Let's go in. Welcome to the dragon shrine. I am Stina, a shaman serving the village chief and high priestess Daria. I presume that you have come to the shrine seeking assistance. Please don't hesitate to ask Chief Daria for guidance. This lady could fit very easily uh, into uh, Escaflone. Hey, you have a young yet gentle air. Hmm? An odd wind swirls around you. I have heard that such wind bearers appear at times, but... Do you speak the truth that you all you are already dead in this world? Hmm, I see. So that's why you have an odd air about you. Well, at least it isn't Taco Bell. As for a way to return to your original world, I do not know. But there are always reasons why such phenomena occur. land of Genesis, your only key may lie there. The key that connects your world to this one. It is, shall we say, a dimensional distortion of sorts. If events in your world are different from events here, it may be possible to save the girl stricken by the Hydra poison. That is, if the extinct Hydra still exists in your world. El Nido has long been called the land where the dragons sleep. There are islands named after dragons and numerous Dragonian ruins and artifacts. You may have encountered some of these already. The most famous are the islands of the Sky Dragon, the Earth Dragon, and the Water Dragon, and the ancient ruin Fort Dragonia that lies to the east. Of the many Dragonian ruins, Fort Dragonia is one of the few that is still fully functional. And the key to activate this ruin is the Dragon Tear. It was given to our ancestors by the extinct Dragonians as a symbol of our friendship. It has been passed down through successive shamans, but... It was stolen and taken away from Goldove by an unknown interloper. Their intent is unknown, but if they plan to activate the ancient ruin, a great disaster shall come about. Our people have been searching for it, but we have found no trace of it. Uh, maybe you should, uh, have destroyed it a while ago? I mean, it's easy to look at things in hindsight, but, you know, maybe this is a lesson for the future. One must choose one's own path, but as long as one is human, one will sometimes become lost. I pray that your journey will be blessed by the guidance of the six great dragon gods. Thanks, I'll get that autosave. A little stuttery right there when I uh, did that. Uh, I will become the wind. Yeah, it'll be 2G in advance. All right, I'll pay 2G. You paid 2G. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Well, please become the wind. And one, and a two. Okay, stand by. Whee! Oh, 
I'm gonna do this one day. All right. Uh, let's see. I don't think I will use... I wonder if I can... I don't think I can access, uh... Lord Smappy's equipment. I need to get used to, uh, everyone having different names. <laughs> nope. Alright. Um, I mean, I got some stuff, I think. I just don't think I got the helmet. Okay, so let's see. If I want to get a carapace... Alright, I can do a tablets. That that's magma bombs. Anything else I'd have a crap ton of? Not really. There we go. So I have a carapace. Oh, just running over here. All right. All right, best I'm uh, see you at 29. And go ahead and get that for uh, Title Rabbit. There we go. Um... Yeah, you can't uh, disassemble the sea swallow. Uh, the copper swallow. I did not actually mean to do that, but it's fine. Uh, what if I? Okay, they're worth 112. I think the copper out of it is worth it. Is worth more right now. Ivory mail. That's fine. We'll wait until we actually like specifically need things, kind of thing. <clears throat> All right, spatula CA twenty. Replace it with Bessum CU twenty nine. Uh, hit percent goes up, attack goes up. A broom made out of copper. Scrub stubborn stains as you sweep. Oh, it's a, it's a broom. Alright. Uh, and then elements. Actually meant to go to you. Alright, um... Uh, let's go with uh, Ice Blast for sure, and I hit the wrong buttons again. I need to, I need to get better at this. Alright, Ice Blast. What else do we want? Um, let's go with an Arrow Saucer. Aqua Beam. And what else? 
else do I have? It's a tablet. I don't have a whole lot at the moment. No new uh, slots for you. We have some new uh, slots for you. Let's give you a photon ray. That's it. All right. Probably should have given a magnify, but whatever. Are you ready to go? Uh, yep, ready anytime. Are you really sure? Don't you dare tell me you want to come back later. Think about it really carefully. Are you positively sure? Uh, yeah, actually, sorry, just a little bit longer. I just realized that it was something else. And get yourself ready. Someone's life depends on you, so hurry up. Jeez, you've got no sense of urgency. To be fair, I did just remember something that I forgot, so... You know... Do you want to come in here? And we can. We don't get much news of the main island out here. Judging from the season, I guess it's about time the El Nido Festival starts. It hasn't rained around here for the longest time. Traders say the water on Water Dragon Island Isle is dried up too. That wind brings back memories. Hey, boy, you're from the main island? Do you know what the Hydra Marshes? It's the forest to the southeast. Although they're called the Hydra Marshes, there are no more Hydras there. Everyone left that forest after the Hydras died off. I, too, left the forest. That place ain't fit for living creatures anymore. Hi-ho, the plants in the marshes respond to the sounds of this tinkler. That ain't no good to me anymore. Here, I'll give this to you, boy. You just go up to a plant and ring it, like that. The plant will open up a path without you touching it. All received green tinkler. Sounds dirty. Oh, hello. For crying out loud, how many times do I have to tell you not to come behind the count? Hey, you're an unfamiliar face, but you're just a customer as well, so out you go. You're in my way. Yeah, sorry. Hello. Welcome. It's a small shop, but feel free to browse. Small shop? Well, you have a portrait. Not everyone with a portrait joins the party, but most people with a portrait try and join the party. She's definitely going to be joining the party eventually. I like her hair. Outfit's cute, too. Okay. But... Let's go ahead and get going. We got our green tinkler now. Sounds so wrong. Ready anytime. Uh, I'm ready. All right, we're off. All you get on the boat. Oh, man, Lena, I am sorry that you... I mean, uh, Tano Rabbit, I am sorry that you're uh, you're sitting on the outrigger rather than in the boat itself. Oh, I need to reposition uh, members of the party, clearly. All right, this is automatic. Well, this is uh, essentially our world map. It is definitely scaled up. That's why it's uh, a bit fuzzy. Hey! Who said you could dock that thing here? Get that thing out of here right now! Hey, don't be such a hardhead. It's not like we're robbing from anyone. Besides, nobody else is docking here, right? That's not the point. What I'm trying to say is... Here, keep it. You can't bribe me with some... <laughs> The delicious scent and the subtle texture. This must be the famous rare drink of the Dragonian's Dragon's Glory. Thought this might happen, so I snagged some from my mom's kitchen. Yeah, all right, I, I, I'll give you special permission this time. But next time, it might not go so easy on you. When that happens... Don't worry, I'll get some more for you. Very well. <laughs> You're pretty quick for a kid. You don't hurry, that girl's gonna die. You guys can't do this alone. Why don't you let me come along? 
Scorcha temporarily joined your party. All right. Uh, let's see. First character, first new character of the uh, recording session, actually. And of course, I forgot to get ready for it, so you know. Let me get my list up. Okay. Let's see, who are we going to get this time? All right. Let's go ahead and change the name. Is this gonna fit? That's a good question. Uh, Gilded Tongue, I think so. All right, welcome to the party, Gilded Tongue. Once I uh, find where the T is, there it is. Yep, just fits. All right, let's go ahead and uh, confirm that. Um, not gonna bring you in the party just yet. But let's go ahead and uh, reposition uh, App Cody and Title Rabbit. If you don't hurry, that girl's gonna be dead. What do you need? Uh, that's nothing. All right. Well, uh, we can take a quick look at his uh, stats. Uh, fisherman and Ferryman, age 16, male. Uh, from Goldove, height 5'6", 123 pounds, built thin, right-handed. Uh, he is blue innate. We have enough blue innate, really, at the moment, so... Uh, 13 strength, accuracy 85, magic 9, resistance 9, agility 6, magic resistance 9, stamina recovery 10. Let's see, have we looked at everyone else? The Wonder Dog? I, I love that. I love that. Dominant Paw Unknown. <laughs> stamina Recovery 9 for Froxus. Tidal Rabbit has Stamina Recovery of 11. Sweet Country Gal. Kinshir. Uh, cursed Voodoo Doll. <laughs> Unknown Male. Uh, only 20 pounds for 6'3 uh, height. Pretty good. Dominant Arm Unknown. Build Reedy. I love that too. <laughs> Uh, also, Stamina Recovery 11. That's pretty good. It's crazy agility on Kinshir. Is there anyone else down there? No. Uh, I don't know if we ever... Oops. Well, you're here. Uh, Masked Magician, 26 male, Zenon Mainland. Uh, 6'2", 154 pounds, tall and slender, right-handed. Uh, stamina Recovery is only 8 for Abcody. Um, tempted to swap him out for Kinshir because of that. Accuracy is only 80. Accuracy is just terrible on him, too. Um, magic 15, magic resistance 11, agility 10, resistance 12, strength 14. Um, part of it is just like, uh, until he gets more slots, um, he's good, he's powerful, but he's also not the best. So, uh, equip. Uh, Gilded Tongue does use the uh, copper lure, fishing lure made out of copper. He uh, does start with copper mail as well. So, but we'll give it some more thought. I don't know if people have changed their uh, conversations. Oh, you know what? Since we didn't recruit Nikki, I wonder if he's going to be back here. Also, I like that it says uh, Telmina Festival. Alright, that's probably unchanged.
<sighs> the concert's been postponed. Nikki's acting strange. I just want to pack up and hurry out of Termina for crying out loud. So I don't think Mickey was here before. Okay, someone did say that there is a way to talk to this lady, so let's go ahead and... Aha, yes. There we go. Do you know if the Radical Dreamers steal laundry too? I'm so worried, I'm going to have to stay here and watch them until they're dry. I'm pretty sure the Radical Dreamers do not steal laundry. Pretty sure. Gonna go out on a limb. A very, very broad, thick unbreaking limb. Get into the shop. Jesus. Oh, Title Rabbit, don't expect any special deals just because I'm your friend. Yeah, I had someone in the comments uh, mention that they had no idea that there was a... Uh, um a uh, special conversation between uh, those two. Um, which I'm pretty sure that I had always uh, brought her along. Did, did we get all of uh, Lord Smappy's uh, elements back? I think so. Just buy a few extras of these. Like, anything that I can equip, um, I should be, like, any of these that, not equip, any of these that I can buy, I really should be putting on, um, uh, secondary characters that I'm not currently using, just so that they're, like, I don't need to unequip people to get fireballs and magma bombs and stuff like that. We're gonna be getting tons of them and, and stuff like that, so, um, I wanna get some more these, just to be on the safe side. And I can always use these as a trading fodder as well. They're not worth it. Like, they don't, they don't sell for that much. Alright, I'm not sure that there's really anyone else changing their uh, conversations much, and there might be some people that we can uh... What? Can I, can I change my party out? Oh, wait, wait, wait. We got the uh, Dragoons on. We get the uh, reward. Who might you be? Fortunes be good, fortunes be bad, anything from reading your destiny to searching for the missing. Do you wish your fortune to be read? Alright, let's go for Ab Cody. Sir Ab Cody, how did it go? Did you find the item? See for yourself, man. Here's proof of my intrusion into Viper Manor. I ask that you give me my reward, as promised at the conclusion of our bet. Um, it is my loss this time. Here is the reward I promised. Take it away. Ab Cody received a copper rod that I already made one of. Poop. Should have given us an iron rod. Alright, well, sh uh, other people will definitely use copper rods, so. Uh, Alright, come back anytime you want a reading. That is all. Alright. I think I want to try swapping people and seeing what she has to say. Let's take Guild of Tongue with us. Oh, I can't swap it out. Alright. Uh, let's see. Actually, yeah, I think he's the only one who hasn't been, uh... 
Yeah, I think he's the only one that we haven't gotten a reading on, so. Let's go see what uh, the fortune teller has to say about Gilded Tongue. And Gilded Tongue. Your fortune tells that yours is a hopeless love. I'm sorry, but you've got to give up. Ah, don't give me such baloney. Alright, all right, come back anytime you want a reading. That is all. Alright. So yeah, I think I'll swap out uh, Abcody for Kinshir. Um... It's going to be a little bit more effective uh, as a black spellcaster at the moment. Oh, can I? Oh, hmm. Right. He's not here, so I can't swap him out here. Can I do that outside of town? Or did I just mess myself up? No, oh, I've got this. I've still got the teleporter. Yeah, there we go. All right. Get Tidal Rabbit back in, and let's go ahead and get Kinshir in. Alright, so Kinshir has way better agility than everyone else by a massive, massive margin. I have no idea what exactly agility does. Um, also has better accuracy... Uh, compared to everyone except for Tidal Rabbit. Um, now, his magic is pretty bad. So that's the thing. Like, Abcody's magic is really high. Resistance, 12. Down to 7. Strength, 14. Strength, 8. Yeah, so... I mean, we'll see. We'll see. Um, we have some optional places that we can go, so I think we're going to go there first. And we'll get a feel for how he um, holds his own kind of thing. But that is going to uh, have to wait until uh, next time. I'll go ahead and uh, swap his uh, stuff around, and we'll see how that goes. See you next time, everyone.